Hey, what's going on fellow wealth builders? Jeremy here with another video. I've been getting a lot of questions, people asking, how do I create a Theta wallet? I'm gonna show you exactly how to do it today. But before we get started, if you wanna follow along my journey as I build wealth for my family, then subscribe to the channel, hit the bell icon so you don't miss a thing. And remember, none of this is financial advice. This is all just my opinion and speculation. I am merely a guy sitting in front of a computer talking to a camera. Let's get to it. All right, so it's pretty straightforward uh, process to do this. I'm gonna walk you through it today. There's basically two different wallets. There's the Theta Wallet web app, and there's a Theta mobile wallet for your phone. I'm not sure if you can create a wallet on your phone or if you have to go to the website first and create it there and then log into it on your phone. Uh, you can try just downloading the app. You might be able to do a lot of these steps there. Uh, but you want to go to thetatoken.org. Make sure it is thetatoken.org. There are a lot of scam websites out there. Whenever, even in the future, when you go back to use your Theta wallet, make sure you go to the original thetatoken.org website and you click on a wallet right here. Now, this is where you will unlock an existing wallet. If you have that wallet, you can either upload the key store file and put in your password or you can enter your 12 word mnemonic phrase, uh, or you can enter your private key and password, or if you have like a treasure or a ledger hardware wallet, you can do that here. But we're gonna go down here and click create wallet. Now this is where you're going to create a, what they call a key store file. This is like a certificate file. That's what a blockchain is. It's a private and public key. So this will create your private key as well as your public key and you have to set a password so this is the password for your key store file once this is generated it's actually going to also create what you've maybe heard 12 word or seed phrase mnemonic phrase it creates that mnemonic phrase off of this key store and password and that mnemonic phrase can recreate the key store and the password. So that's sort of how those two are tied together. One, I would make sure that you write this password down somewhere safe. And two, you want to save this key store file somewhere. So we're going to have go ahead and do that. So I'm going to put in password I've created. And it, this is a very important checkbox. I understand that Theta cannot recover or reset the password or key store file. I will make a backup of the key store file password. Keep them secret. Complete all wallet creation steps. Check. Download the key store file. This is where it's going to actually download the file to your computer. Now here's what I suggest you do. Save it to a USB drive or two USB drives and store them somewhere securely in a safe or somewhere. These are literally the keys to the kingdom. If somebody has either of those, then they have access to your account. So we'll go ahead and click download key store. All right, so this has downloaded that key store file. Now what it's saying is mnemonic phrase. We are about to show your mnemonic phrase. Please ensure no one can see your screen before you continue. Now this is where I suggest you turn off your Wi-Fi. Just in case for some reason somebody's spying on your computer Turn your Wi-Fi off, disconnect from the, the internet before you reveal your 12 word phrase. Again, this 12 word phrase can recreate your entire wallet. So if somebody gets a hold of these and they have access to your entire wallet, they can do whatever they want. So we'll click continue and I'm gonna write down these on paper. I would not save these on a computer anywhere. I would put these on a piece of paper and store them in a safe place probably have two copies of this. You probably want to have two copies um, saved, maybe laminate the paper so that if they get wet, it won't ruin them. Uh, put them in a fireproof safe, maybe put two copies somewhere. Either way, these are the keys to the kingdom. I know I'm stressing that, but there's been plenty of people who have given over these, these words, their mnemonic phrase to somebody that says they can help them. And they get scammed out of everything. So don't ever, ever give uh, these away. In fact, I've got a video up here. I talked about a scam. You can go click up there and uh, go watch that video. Let me write these down and then click continue. And now it says you are ready to use your wallet. You'll want to turn back your Wi-Fi, and you can click on unlock wallet. All right. So now you're taken back here. You've created that wallet. You can either upload that key store file 
that you uh, just downloaded and put in the password that you just created or you can go over here to mnemonic and put in your 12 word mnemonic phrase and then enter a temporary password this is just a password for the session it doesn't really matter this password is only going to use be used one time and unlock wallet i like to to unlock it with your mnemonic the first time just to make sure that you have entered and typed in those 12 word phrases i would hate for you to set, start sending tokens to this wallet and then realize after the fact that you wrote down your mnemonic phrase incorrectly. At this point you have a Theta wallet. You can go and download the Theta mobile app and you can uh, restore that wallet on the mobile app using that 12 word phrase. Um, you Also something here, every transaction on Theta requires T-Fuel. So if you put Theta into this wallet but you have no T-Fuel, you cannot send Theta out of this wallet. But Theta was smart. They created a place within the wallet. If you go to T-Fuel, go to Receive. There's this little button right here that says Receive a small amount of T-Fuel on Mainnet. Just click on that. All it's going to give you is a tiny, tiny bit of T-Fuel into your wallet. But that way, you can actually process transactions. I think it gives you about 10 transactions worth. I mean, it's like a fraction one one thousandths or hundred thousandths of a penny something like that or I'm sorry one one thousandths or whatever it is one hundred thousandths of a T fuel very small amount but that's the benefit of a theta and T fuel is the transaction costs are so low especially when you look at what Ethereum is doing right now with their gas prices it's absurdity all right and that it'll, that'll probably take time but you should at some point receive all right, so that's it for this video. If it was helpful, please like the video, share it with a friend, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more videos like this. I've got a whole other video starting right over here. Click on that. I'll see you over there.